mis amores, como esta? I'm doing fine, thank you for asking. Today's video is going to be on this natural smoky eye with this red lip. And it's my first impression on the ColourPop Double Intendre. Intendre? This palette right here. I love it, I think it's amazing. I always love ColourPop. If it's ColourPop, I'm probably going to like it. Give this video a like, subscribe, join the Lavi family on IG at Louisa Lavi. Show love and I'll show it right back. Let's be a big happy family. Face is prepped and primed. Now going into the ColourPop Double and Tendre. I think that's how you pronounce it. I'm going to go into the shade Locked and Loaded, which is closest to my skin tone. For the crease, lower lash line, and outer V, I'm going to mix three shades. Naked, Extracurricular, and Nip Slip. Using the shade Teddy Bear, I'm going to intensify the look by focusing it onto the outer V and lower lash line. Going into the Maybelline Liquid Eyeshadow in Gilded Rose, I'm going to create a base on just half of the eyelid for the shadow that I will apply later on. Wetting my brush with a priming spray, I'm going into the ColourPop I Think I Love You palette into the shade Level Up and apply it wherever I apply the Maybelline Gilded Rose. Only happened once. Going back into Double Tendre palette, I'm gonna go into the shade Keep It PG and apply it on the other half of the eyelid. Because I apply two shimmer shadows on the lid, it can transfer to the crease. So in order to keep the look blended out, because blending is the key to makeup, I'm going into the shades Extracurricular and Nip Slip. This step is optional like every other step, but I decided I want to wing out my look in order to make my lashes appear fuller. So going into the shadow Hot Bod, it's this deep brown. I'm creating a wing. You know I had to pop the Flexitarian out. So we're applying Flexitarian on the tear duct of the eye. I felt that I needed a little bit more coverage, not extreme, but just a hint of coverage. So I went into the NYX Total Control Drop Foundation in Vanilla. It's contouring time, so I like to focus on the cheekbones, the jawline, the nose, and don't forget the neck. And I also like to apply some color on the forehead. It's seho time! So for eyebrows, I like to create two lines. One under the brow, one above the brow. I connect the lines, fill in the brow, and then with a small detail brush, I like to clean up and focus on the tail of the eyebrow. You gotta believe me when I say 
Using the Gimme More ColourPop highlight palette, I'm going into the shades Upgrade and Total Service. Just for show, yeah. She said, save your 